making bracelets and necklaces and things. I know that everybody asked, well, most of you asked <laughs> for me to do another bead video, like bracelet making type video. And so we are going to do that today since I have been cranking out some necklaces and bracelets in my free time. So I'm going to just start off by showing you some of the things I have done. I'm also sorry about my nails if you see them when I show them. Um, because I keep like reaching in the beads. I don't know if there's dust in the beads or if it's just like stuff from the factories that I come from, I guess, um, rubbing off of them. But there is like, it, there's stuff under my nails currently because I've been playing with the beads and then as I grab them, my nails are probably going to get worse. Um, this only really happens when my nails are short. When they're long, I find that I don't get like, you know, it doesn't look like I've got goo gotch under my nails. But, um, yeah. And these pink beads, oh, you can't even, you can't even see them. They're like way up here. Uh, they're like magenta color rubs off of them. So if I touch those, my hands will be pink. I don't know why. I think I've got to like wipe them down a little bit before I put them in the store. Um, let's start by showing you some new beads I got though. I got some rainbow beads in this container. I feel like I purchased a container of these that has been opened and beads have been taken out of it, but maybe not. Like, I can't remember if it looked like this at the store. I've only taken out six beads from here, so it shouldn't look like that. But this one, jam-packed, could be the size. I don't know. Just play around and see what happens. 
hopefully this video can be more lo-fi. Um, my dogs are down here with me. Oh, one just got scared. Uh, I had a dream. <laughs>
obviously with this pastel looking aesthetic so <laughs>
because ah uh, because I missed one. Oh my gosh. Stop. 
Seven, seven, seven. 